Phew, what a day. I need to lie down for a few minutes to regain some energy. Huh? What's this? <gasps> How did they get here? Huh, I need to ask Sam. Huh? <gasps> oh! Looks like our house is gradually turning into one big coin box. Sam, we need to talk. <laughs> What's all this? Oh, you found my coins! Yay! I know these are coins, but what are they doing under the pillow and in my shoe? Uh, I forgot to warn you that I'm saving money for a super purchase! Saving money in my sneakers? Those are my hiding spots! But there's a problem. The problem is that those sneakers are not a coin box! No! I keep forgetting where I put the money. I think I know how to help you. <laughs> Come on. I suggest making a money bank for your coins. Then you won't forget where you put your savings. Ugh, no! Money banks are so boring! Old-fashioned. Um, I haven't finished yet. It will be an automatic money box. And very fun. Will it automatically steal my money? <laughs> Almost. Will it automatically give my money back? If it gives you your money back, you will never have the sum you need. Perhaps you're right. Now we need to draw an outline on the cardboard. To draw some teeth. Did I hear right? You're drawing teeth? You mean this toothy money box will munch my coins? Oh, don't forget that these are cardboard teeth. They're drawn. Does it matter? These jaws look fearsome, like a shark! <laughs> uh, um, a little bit more. There. Oh, it looks scary! Don't worry, it's your future money box. The toothy guy can rest for now, and I'm going to need this lid. That's where the money will fall. I'll unscrew the lid for now and insert the plastic piece into the box. Right into this opening. I need to screw it in carefully. And put the lid back on. Perfect. See? Hey, Sam, could you please help me cut out these pieces for the teeth? Sure, sure. I knew you couldn't do without me. To make the teeth snowy white, we won't paint them. Just glue some paper over them. Take them quickly before the glue dries out. Carefully now. And repeat on the other side. There. <laughs> this smile is as white as a toothpaste commercial. Or like in a shark! Now we're going to repeat the trick with paper. And we'll cover the whole box with green paper. Be careful with the corners. It's best to use self-adhesive paper here. Go nice and slow to avoid any bubbles under the paper. You didn't say which size the eyes should be. That's why I cut out a lot of them. Oh, these will do perfectly. Yes, <laughs> they look great. They look kind of evil. Well, it'll have to scare strangers away from your treasures. So I think it's just the right look. This won't do. Let's make stands from cardboard. They'll keep our money box stable. And there. Perfect, see? Sue, can I make a toy for Fluffy out of this thing? Oh no! We need this thing for our money box. I'll get something else. Now we can start making the mechanism for our automatic money box. I need to bend this wire a few times. Be careful with pliers, guys. It needs some effort. This is what we get. Now I need to secure the wire inside the money box in the openings I made in advance. There you go. Aha! Looking good. Guys, I hope you're watching our videos attentively. If you do, watch this video to the end and write how many coins I used in this video. Sam, that seems like a difficult task. I'm sure our viewers can do it. Now comes the most interesting and difficult part. First, I'll draw an outline on this wooden stick. No ruler needed. Oh, I almost forgot. I need to make an opening. Ask an adult to help you with the drill. There. Be careful! 
Why are you wearing glasses? To stay safe, of course. Oh. Let's attach this piece to the motor. Great. Now let's start assembling. I'll remove this piece so it won't get in the way. But we'll need it later. And I'll glue the cardboard base here. It'll hold the motor with the wires. Carefully now. And... There. Perfect. It should look like this. Where am I going to throw my coins? Into the mouth? We'll make a special arm. A money box with arms and teeth? Oh no! I'll need these two cardboard pieces. And also, these half-circle pieces of foil with wires attached to them. And we need to put them together. Like this. This is the money receiver we made. And moving on to the arms. I'll measure 4.5 centimeters on these wooden sticks. Now we really do need the ruler. <laughs> and I'll make a cut. Not actually a cut. I'll use a file for that and make a dent. Not all the way through, see? And you get this kind of bend. I'll apply some glue along the bend to make it sturdier. Could you make these for me as well? What for? Well, I don't know. I'll scratch Fluffy with them. <laughs> I'll think about it. Let's assemble our machine now. One arm. And the other one. Just put them on the wire. There. I should secure it with glue. Just in case. And now, it's time to attach the coin receiver. Don't be shy with the glue. It should hold really well. And I think it looks good! Let's hide all of these wires inside the box. One. Yeah. Whew. Working with wires can be difficult. But the results are totally worth it. And the other one. Nice and slow. We need to add an accumulator to make our mechanism work. There. We only need to connect it now. Huh. There are so many wires in here. Huh. Let's see. Look! I decorated our money box with these ridges. Now it's even more fearsome. No thief will dare touch Sam's coins. And I also connected all the wires inside the box. Now I only need to cover all the insides with cardboard. We have to make sure the coins don't fall inside. Some glue should help secure it. But not too much. Yes! Perfect! And I need to attach the arms to the wires. On both sides. Done! Hey Sam, come give this money machine a try! Coming! Oh! Oh, <laughs> let me try. <gasps> yeah, it works! Do it again! I'll start with the smallest one. <laughs> awesome! More. Yay! Oh, this is so cool! Wow! And the biggest one. Yes! Now three small ones. Wow! Awesome! Okay, two middle-sized ones. And... <gasps> oh, amazing! Oh, let me try! <gasps> it's awesome! Hey guys, do you like our new machine? Tell your friends about our channel and give this video lots of thumbs ups! Bye! Here, I have found all the necessary stuff. It seems that it will be a really cool project. <laughs> right you are, Sam. Hmm, something's missing here. Uh, Sam, could you please fetch me some barbecue sticks from the kitchen? I can feel something awesome coming! <laughs> so, there are thin and thick sticks. Which ones do you need? Uh, you can bring both. I'm back! And why do you need these sticks? You'll see. Would you like to see some magic? Sure I do! A bibbity bobbity Boo! Oh, I can only my turn. Whoosh! Oh wow! <laughs> That's even better. Oh, that slime sweet tooth. 
So we have to install bicycle spoke fragments into pen pieces, just like this. Already done. Wow, that looks great, Sammy. Now we need to tape the handles. Ouchie! Sue, could you please do it yourself? This tape, I don't like it. <laughs> okay, Sammy. Can you even imagine how many different tapes there are in the world? Hmm. Now we measure the necessary length on popsicle sticks. We need two similar parts. It's good that I like ice cream. Otherwise, we would be short on sticks. <laughs> right. We couldn't do it without you, Sammy. The stick goes here. Hmm. What is it? Patience. You'll know soon. Oh. And here we insert our pen into this part like this. Looks like… Um, what actually is it, Sue? So we measure a circle with the compass. We will need two of those… and a smaller one. Sam, do you want to cut out the circle? <laughs> no, this is way too easy for me. <laughs> Would you look at him? Then maybe you can help me stick them to each other? <laughs> Leave it to a true master. <laughs> Go ahead, Sam. I am sure you will need this. Oh, thanks, Sammy. You are 100% right. <laughs> what did I say? Professionals always have everything on hand. <laughs> Sue, are you sure that in the end we will have a piggy bank and not a car? Of course, Sammy. Look, Sam, we have a challenge here. Can you tackle it? Sure. I can even do it with my eyes closed. You are doing such a great job, Sam. A real pro. Oh, yes, that's me. Um, be careful with the cutter, Sam. Whatever, I'm a pro. Did you forget? Sam, since you want to store cash as well, are you saving for something big? Uh, don't ask me. Otherwise, I'll tell you and the surprise will be ruined. Okay, okay, I won't. Here, you have to be careful since we need to cut only the upper and middle cardboard layer. This is a peculiar piggy bank. I'm very excited to use it. Just a little more patience. It'll be ready soon. Uh, a piggy bank with windows? This looks even cooler than the magical one. Really? I think that the magical piggy bank was very beautiful. Could you please pass me the pencil so I can fold this piece nicely? Here you go. Let's wrap this piece around the pencil. Just look how nice it is. And now we stick it right here. Guys, don't forget about safety when working with glue guns. One can easily get burned. I'm not afraid of anything, but I still trust you with such things. Uh, what happened, Sue? Is something missing? Yes, two round pieces of cardboard. Could they be in the box? They were on the floor, but I picked them up. Oh, thank you, Sammy. Sue, that looks familiar. Those wheels with sticks inside? I'm sure I've seen it before. Seriously? Where? I'm thinking, thinking, trying to remember. You'll remember it for sure. See, there's a handle here. You can spin it if you like. I'm also sure that I have spinned something like this before. Whoa! We have constructed almost the same thing for one of our money banks! Oh, yeah! That was a good money bank. By the way, where is it? It… it is… Uh, somewhere that's saving money. That's what it's made for. Well, I hope that's so. Look how cool it is. Wanna try? It is fun to turn this handle, but I would like to start saving money. For the next step, I made these thingies. It looks like a little swing! Are we making a playground for money? A swing, you say? I call it a trampoline rather than a swing. Trampoline! I want to jump on one of those. Me too. I could play on those all day long. Now the rubber band goes into this little hook. It's to wait until the glue is dried. But we can always stick it once more. Sure, but it's better when things are working the first try. Do you want to see how the coins will jump on our trampoline? Absolutely! Oh boy, that's awesome! Now it's looking more like a real piggy bank. A bit weird though. I can't wait to see it! 
Well, you asked me for an unusual one for coins and cash, so nothing's weird here. However, I might surprise you now. Sam, remember when you wanted to be a spy? Oh, sure. Why are you asking me about it now? Because we'll make a spy combination lock. Wow! And it'll even have a code? Of course! Not a hard one. Really easy to remember. Phew! I already thought I would have to carry around a paper with a password. Sammy, could you please help me one more time? Make a snip right here. I'm on it. Done! It was a piece of cake. Good job! Look what I made. It would serve as the second part for our lock. Sam, which letter is your favorite? The letter C for candy! You know it perfectly well. Awesome, then we'll use it. But don't tell anyone. Now we'll stick the back part to our piggy bank. Only the lock support is left. And voila, the piggy bank is done. So, did you just say that the piggy bank is done? I sure did. But, but, <laughs> I'm just kidding, we can't do without the decoration. Phew! Susie, don't scare me like that! A craft without a decoration? Well, you know. I do, I do. Boom! Now the mission is complete! Alright! Let's test it! Come on, Susie! Hurry up and put my money in there so I can start saving! No problem! Wait, what's this? Aw, what a nice LOL set! Oh, oh no! You shouldn't have seen it! I, I wanted to buy it for you as a present! Aw, oh, that's why you're saving the money? You're so <laughs> sweet, Sammy! Ah, uh, Sue, you're my best friend! Wanted to make you happy. <laughs> then let's fill our piggy bank quick to get happy together. And it goes. Wow! And a coin. Oh. <laughs> Some more. Yeah! Amazing! <laughs> uh, oh. It's a great start! 